Good day, everyone. Good day. It's Friday, February 9. We made it to Friday, but we're not done yet, so no slacking off. No one gets to slack off because it's Friday. Still so much to do. It's early in the day. Early in the day. And see, I'm getting ahead of myself, so I'm starting to slack off. Can't do that. Continuing with efficiency in the workplace. Now, yesterday I alluded to this. Now, let's talk about lack of organizational vision. Remember I said about the one message. That's the vision. That is the organizational vision. That, and so long as it's shared across the board and everybody fully understands, and I'm talking from CEO down to the frontline staff, down to the customer, the client, the stakeholders, as long as they know what's going on and you can get everybody on board and you have an organizational vision, guess what? Motivation goes through the roof because everybody is working towards a common goal. Yes, even the, even the individual that brings the toner for the copier is on board. If you can do that, wow, wow, because now you're buying people in, you're bringing people from the outside in, the other stakeholders, the other internal stakeholders, and then the external stakeholders start hearing about what's going on, and then you start increasing, you start increasing, and you start getting abundant, and you start to grow, and you start to have, and now you start to give back more. Now the employees get those bonuses. Because again, the vision was that we're going to be efficient, we're going to grow, we're going to produce more, and we're going to succeed, succeed together. That's really the only way. There's no other way of succeeding. Sure, one person can write a bestseller, but guess what? Bestseller means there has to be best buyers. Get it? See, just because they wrote that, doesn't mean people are gonna are gonna buy hand over fist. I know I've written my books. I I can't say it's a bestseller, but you know what? I've written them, and I appreciate each and every one that's that's purchased my book because they saw the visions. They saw they saw my vision in the writing. They understood. They took a chance on me. They wrote it. They didn't return the book. So I'm glad. I really am glad. But do you understand what I'm getting here? Is that so long as the vision is clear? and people understand what you're selling and what you're doing and what you're trying to accomplish, sure, it might be that we're gonna be efficient, we're gonna produce more, but it also means in producing more and being more efficient, we're gonna give more to the customer than just the book. That's why I'm doing these videos, because it's more than just the book. It is for you to take in, internalize, and realize that, hey, there's more to being a leader, and there's little things that happen as part of being a leader. And one of those things is to share the organizational vision. Now, if the vision needs to be brought into the 21st century, then by all means, be the by all means be the first one to step up and say, "Hey, I think we need to bring this up to date. I think we might have a little situation, a little interpretation." And again, that falls on you as a leader at any level, at any level. So get to work. You've got to do it, and it's got to get done. Folks, my name is David Garrett. It's Friday, February 9. We're not done yet with today, so get to work. And uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow.